All right, coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. All right, so here she is, one of the more prolific kickboxers to cross into the UFC in some time. She might kick harder than you, bro. Oh, yeah, she does kick so hard. I mean, you look at the videos. The videos are all out there. And you watch this young lady landing these brutal leg kicks on the bag, landing the high kicks, the body kicks. It's, it's unreal to watch someone of this stature able to land and be as physical as she is. She's so aggressive in her approach. She's so comfortable in such tight confines that her opponents usually panic because they can't understand, as we can't, how she could be okay when she's under duress as she is. I asked her to kick me in the leg at our fighter meeting on Thursday, and as you see, I'm still limping. So she packs some power, and her opponent better be ready for her here tonight. Well, drillers make killers, and nobody works her takedowns harder than this young woman. She has become a force in this division, and even though the opposition oftentimes knows what's coming, no one's able to stop that shot. Nobody's able to stop that takedown attempt. No one's able to stop that single leg. She said in the fighter meetings, I have drilled that takedown 5,000 times. Amazing. Over and over, I hit a single leg. Every day of the week, I hit at least 30 single legs. I'm like, well, is wrestling practice every day? She goes, no. I just want to make sure that I have a skill that is so dominant that no matter how much you practice it, you are not practicing it enough to stop me from taking you down with it. It is truly crazy to watch her approach to getting that single leg off. And her ability to get her opponents off balance in a mixed martial arts setting, as special as anybody in the sport right now. We'll see how it goes for her here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, her team. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Priceless. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of New York, New York, shut down. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. So here we go with round one, two decorated strikers here. And I would think even a world-class wrestler like yourself still enjoys a classic stand-up affair like this every night. Oh, yeah, I love this one. I love this one because both of these women know that the easiest way to get their hands raised is to fight in the area that they are best. Both of them are fantastic strikers. One is much more powerful. One is much more quick. Let's see who gets the job done. Oh, how is she standing? Brutal knee to the body. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. Back to the feet. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, big punch land. All right, so another swing and a miss, and I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you gotta find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can oh, You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? Oh! An uppercut landed! Chase 
the finish. So a nice what a fight so oh. far! So a lot of high-level striking in that last round, but the big shot, of course, to the head that stunned her opponent nearly got her out of it. I mean, she hurt her bad. I, I can't believe that we are going to another round. I thought it was over. She landed it perfectly. Usually that's enough to end the fight. Unfortunately, the round goes on. Let's see what happens. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Oh, and she connects there. So. Oh! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. That was no! the clean No! Oh, my God! Oh, and with conviction, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. Oh, her ground and pound is on point here. She's made this a focus going in to make these strikes count. Certainly doing that tonight. She's making each and every one of them count, doing a very, very good job of landing shots, landing them in combination, and making them all matter. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Nice job staying busy here, working off of her back. Oh, well played there as she gets back to her feet. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace. Whoa! You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? Oh, massive kick to the body. Trying to stay in this fight! Able to check the high kick. All right, so now she engages in the tie clinch, and of course, if you're fighting hands as the opponent, you'll leave everything else wide open. You leave everything open, and she will dig big, brutal knees to the body. All right, so there is the horn, so we will see another round. You thought maybe with that knockdown that that could have been the end. You thought it was over. People don't usually get up from those types of strikes. She took that big punch, continued to plod forward, but if she does not move her head, her night will be over very quickly. Third round underway. So we have crossed the midpoint in this one. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Oh, and just like that, the fight is over. It's over. It's over. What a fight. Most fighters in this division get knocked out by that strike. Near perfect execution. She found a little crack in the defense and found a home for that strike. Landed flush. And that is another one for the highlight reel, but few prettier than that one as she gets the big knockout win here tonight. And there she is after the massive knockout. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 47 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout. Right. Are you ready? <laughs>